Hey everybody, what better way to spend a uh, day off than to come out here and hang out? This is actually my office, so I like my job so much, I come in even on my day off. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> check it out, brand new hat, all leather, Australian made, look at that, yeah, real nice. I picked up a uh, concho from a powwow a couple years ago, I've been trying to figure out what to uh, put it on. And uh, what better way to, you know, display that really cool concho, but on the hat. And it came with a concho, but I didn't like it, so I swapped it out. But anyways, uh, with the brand new hat, I got a brand new pair of shoes. So uh, Watt Elves, they liked my review from before, so they wanted me to review another pair of shoes that they're trying out. And uh, I have been loving these new shoes. They are their, their mid-top hiker. As you can see here, it's a quite a bit different than my original ones. Uh, the, uh, my original ones had a low top, and uh, that caused that pulverized seashell to go down inside. I always complained about that. Well, this mid top right here prevents that, and I'm loving it. I think that they're better as a water shoe because the insole from my last ones um, would absorb water and it'd stay wet for a long time. And, but uh, these ones have an insole that does not absorb water, okay? It does have minimal amount of impact uh, resistance, but uh, out here, it's 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 pretty soft. I mean, the the water here with uh, beach sand and, and seashells and things like that, it's not so bad. But uh, what really sold me on it is the fact that I can walk around through all this pulverized seashell and not get into my shoe. That at the end of the night is horrible. So I have been wearing these shoes for the last two months. Well, as soon as the weather was warm enough for me to actually um start wearing these shoes because uh it did get pretty chilly this past winter but uh now the weather's warming up the water's warming up it's really nice out these shoes have been performing really well uh these are lace-up type so we don't have to worry about that goofy little bead lock that rusts out because of the salt water out here uh now i also noticed that it has this faux uh, suede leather toe and heel which offers a really nice resistance against uh, you know kicking rocks or little roots or branches and stuff like that it's not too bad um, I wouldn't recommend it as a hiker though because um, it just it just feels like you're barefoot unless you like that sort of thing I don't I like my feet protected when I'm hiking so this as a hiker nah, not so much but the original pair that I received I would recommend that as a hiker more so because uh, it has offers up a lot more cushion but uh as far as a water shoe is concerned that one is less ideal than this one right here so out here i spend a lot of time on the water i'm in and out of this water constantly sometimes between three to five hours at any given night and uh these shoes drain off very quickly so that my feet don't feel very wet they don't feel uncomfortable because they've been sitting in a wet shoe for a long period of time but um as you can see this mesh material here drains off very quickly it's got holes at the bottom of the soles there water water drains off very fast the uh the laces they don't have that little bead lock that going on there so there you don't have to worry about corrosion in the little spring right there so these are actually very simple very solid design so i highly recommend picking up a pair of these wad elves mid top hikers they're really comfortable uh they're better as a water shoe than a hiker but um, I highly recommend picking up. I'll leave a link in the description where you can pick up yourself some. They run about you know 30 to 40 bucks a pair. And uh, yeah, so I'm really, really stoked with these shoes. I'm super happy with them. Thank you, Wad Elves. Jungle J approved.